Hey everybody, it's Jacob here, back with some more discourse in the last episode we survived. A deadly plane crash, we fought off the bulls with the help of Garrett, although he's got his guts cut open. That sounds a lot more violent than it actually was, but anyway, it's the second day, and uh, we have a choice. We need to find some fresh water, I can explore the crash site, or we need to go get some sort of signal. I don't know, um, fresh water will probably be the most pressing issue, because the human body can, you can only go, like, three days before you die of dehydration, so I think that's gonna be the main thing we need to do, although we could find some fresh water at the crash site, um, and it is possible we could get rescued within two days, possibly, it's unlikely, but... I think the best way to progress would be to explore the crash site and try to find some fresh water there. Steve's right. There could be valuable supplies that were on the plane. Alright, dear. I'll help you two dig through the plane wreckage then. Someone should go look for a lake or a spring with fresh water. St. Garrett, he seems like that kind of guy that could use a trip. He seems like the kind of guy that could use a trip. Uh, I... Don't be rude to Garrett! Oh, stop whining! It won't be that hard to look around the island. This is, this is not a solo task. There is no way I can get the quest reward alone. Take George with you. He's the best help you can find. Just go, Garrett. You'll be fine. Alright, do your thing then, guys. Okay, Steve, you know where the wreckage is? Yeah, it's pretty hard to miss. Just follow me. It's not too far. Alright, lead on. I guess Teddy's gonna stay here because his legs are all jacked up. Makes sense. Makes sense. All right, we're gonna scavenge this wreckage. Sure is crazy to see all of this. Oh wait, no, it's that's Jolene's. Sure is crazy to see all of this. It's hard to believe that anyone could survive that. Why? Were you on the plane? Of course I was on the plane. I was nominated to compete in the International Latte Arts Championship. Wait. So, so what do you do for a living? Normally I work as a barista at a local coffee shop. Uh, sounds better than my job. Eh, going to car at college hasn't really paid off yet. That's true, I often wonder the same thing. I'm going to college right now, and I plan to go into film and cinema. Is this gonna pay off in the end? Because from what... Anyway, that's that's a whole nother video vlog that I should talk, make a video about, actually, or something. What? Yeah, it's hard to say. If you ask me, college ain't even worth it. Nobody asked you. Well, I'm just saying my George never went to the college. He takes me on vacations multiple times every year. That's really great, Jolene. Steve, were you on some business trip or something? Oh, um, I was forced to go on a vacation by our staff therapist. A forced vacation? That, that doesn't sound so bad. Yeah, well, I threw a stapler across the office at my boss. And you didn't get fired? I was given the you're a valuable asset to the company speech. They still neglect to promote me though. Hmm, I can see that. I can see why he'd be a bit perturbed by this. Oh man, the art in this game is so beautiful. And this music, I'm definitely buying the soundtrack. I might link you all to the soundtrack uh, as well. I'm looking, I'm not seeing anything. Per oh, oh, here we go. Investigate plane further. Let's do this. There's probably some useful stuff lying in there. That piece of metal there. Why don't you see if you can lift it? I'm like, bro, shouldn't you be doing that? You're like the strong man here. Ugh, it's way too heavy. Jolene, get over here. Steve, get over here. You're the guy here. Guys are biologically, gener and generally speaking, stronger than women. Nice. You guys are pretty strong. Well, it comes with working on the farm all those years. They do teach that in those colleges of yours, actually. Okay, let's focus, guys. Just start looking for supplies or whatever. Oh, I think I see something over here. Oh, I see a suitcase. Oh, awesome. It's a box of emergency flares. This will be so useful. Weird, it kind of smells like alcohol over here. Oh, my goodness, that ain't alcohol. It's just, it's jet fuel. Steve, your cigarette! Oh no, Steve! Steve! I'm surrounded! Um, try to jump out. Uh, stay where you are. He should be okay there. I'll think of something. Well, hurry up and think of something. I don't have much time. Uh, look there, the tail. We can push it over. Come on, Jolene. 
I thought you were. Come on. Gotta save my boy Steve. Gotta save my boy Steve. Oh, crap. Okay, push it over. Good work, you two. Oh, he made it. We did it. Not only did we make it through all that, but now we've got these flares as well. That should be helpful. Looks like it's starting to get late. We should go back to camp. This place is burned up anyway. There's nothing left here. Dang it, Steve. You burned up. That's probably why it would have been good to have Steve get burned. We probably could have found more supplies if uh, we had uh, the other dude. Where Are we missing someone? I feel like we're missing somebody. Anyway, well, we found these flares. It was a rough run, but we made it pretty a pretty good team. On that note, we weren't able to get any water. Ugh, can anyone do anything around here? I feel like I'm back at the office. Um, well, I spent most of the day lost. Are you serious? How? Wasn't George with you? He thought he knew where he was going. We got a little separated. All of the plants look the same. Let's get some shut-eye. We can look into it tomorrow. Yeah, I think we could all use some rest. I'll grab a torch. We should find our way to our tent. Okay. Yeah. Okay, tomorrow definitely water searching day. We gotta find water. Who to talk to? I'm gonna talk to Steve. Oh, the wreckage was quite a mess. I can't believe that anyone survived that. Some sort of karma must have been on your side. Heh. <laughs> it's never seemed to help in the past. Hey, we're still alive, aren't we? Good point, I suppose. Good night, Steve. Let's go ahead and talk to Teddy, see how he's doing. I'm telling you, we must come up with a way to signal the passing boats and things. Maybe we can get around to that tomorrow. The longer we wait, the more opportunities we may miss. You're right, He's that's true. I suppose that makes sense. We'll have to take care of it tomorrow. Good, I'm glad you're seeing it my way. Now, let's get some rest. I concur, okay, we can talk to one more person. Let's talk to, who do I talk to? Let's talk to Garrett. It sucks that we weren't able to get that water. Yeah, we're going to have to figure that out soon. I just hope I don't get kicked out of the guild for this. <laughs> the guild. <laughs> Video game jokes, people. Always good. I'm pretty sure you'll be fine. I just... I have to get off this island. We all went off, Garrett. Do you think the rest of us don't want to get out of here? No, you don't understand. I can't afford to be stuck on this island right now. What? What do you mean? I can't even complete a simple fetch quest for water. What if that means I'm going to fail my I... Hold on. What if that means I'm going to fail my IRL quest because I'm stuck on this island? What are you talking about? This is real life. What quest is so urgent that you can't do it later? Without my help of all the friends... Of all my friends... Without my help, all of my friends will be homeless. What is he talking about? Are you paying rent for them? What? Oh, whatever it is, you'll get home. You'll get home. Everything's going to be okay. I sure hope you're alright. Torch is low. Time for me to go to sleep. Alright, well, it looks like that was a short episode today. Dang, guys. Wow. That was really short. Dang. Okay. Well, as always, guys, thank you for watching. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Yes, get shut-eye, Rita. Get shut-eye. That's right. Bye-bye, guys.